everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Inheritance. So we are back just before the next atta attack contract. We did well the last time. The Lyrans are down to two. Rassel Hag's at um, 19. So this battle that we're about to take should finish them off on this planet. So let's go ahead and advance. The Actually, before we do that, let's go to the barracks first. Because we do have some skill points to spend here. So Granite's got a, his ability to take tactics now. Um, which will increase his initiative and sensor holes and stuff. So I'm going to do that and crank that up. Then I think we're going to start working on guts. Or maybe just save up. I don't know. We'll fit, we, I'll probably crank up guts to see what happens with that. But right now we're going to take, take the tactics and confirm Training that. Complete. And then I think in this particular battle we're not going to get a chance to... Um, like we'll have one mech missing. So I'm thinking we're going to probably have to take an extra vehicle. So I'm probably going to bring Hellcat in into the fight here. So let's spend some points on Hellcat if we've got them. We don't. Okay, so... Aye, aye. Killjoy's good. Ready Lethal should be good. Yeah, we've got a bit for piloting, so let's do that. Get a bit of extra speed. Mech warrior training complete. Which is always nice. Uh, Mothman should still be good. Mermilo will be out this battle. Standing by. Uh, Puka's still fine. Taser face. Alright, so... We've been saving points. So we're going to go with gunnery, I think, on this one. Crank that up. Confirm that. And then let's go... Uh, Zephyr, we're just going to leave. Commander. We don't need to spend any points on him because he's not actually doing anything right now. And as soon as we spend points, it's just he's just going to cost us more salary. So there's no point in doing that just yet. All right, so... Um, yeah, let's advance the timeline one day. So we got lots of weight we can drop now. Um, weakening the war effort doesn't really tell you what it is. Powerful spaghetti. Operation Powerful Spaghetti. So let's go with... Um, we're doing well. Let's go with Max Out Salvage on this. It's a three skull. We should be able to finish that pretty quickly, I think. Let's go Max Salvage. Yeah. See what we can get from this. Okay, so um, we're going to drop Mermilo for now. We're going to bring in Hellcat. And we'll bring in the... I'm in the Cloudbuster because it's got more armor. And it can just sit back and take pot shots. So let's bring that in. Um, it, I mean, doesn't look like a Hellcat. But looks good enough. And uh, I think that's it. We're two and a half skull rating, but that's fine. Let's go. Command interface initiated. All right, so this should be the last battle. Let's just say we're attacking their command post. Time to get dirty. Oh, we're escorting a convoy. And the enemies are, like, right there. All right. We can move in from here. Three skull convoy escort, eh? Actually, let's do... Um, can we split up? I'm interested to see what we, who we can put where. So our first mech is the Talos. Like, let's say we do... So the Talos. Then it's the Marauder. Wolverine. Right? And then... I'm trying to think now. No. That's the Cephalus. So the next one is the Cloud Buster, which... I'm thinking about putting the vehicles... Will it, will it allow us to put them here? It won't. we got to be close together. Damn it. You think it's weird because we have two dropships, right? Um, sure, let's just put us all over here. Why not? No, nope, let's get rid of that last one. That would be on the cliff face. Let's go there. That should be it, right? Isn't that it? Now it is.
This way I only have to send... Well, I'll, shit. All of our light mechs are... Uh, damn it. Well, I've only got to send one mech over that way. And it's going to save me time bringing everyone back this way. we got to go this way anyway because the out is here. Right? The, for the escort. So... Well, no. Ta I mean, taser face can get all the way over there. Let's go see what we're up against. Let's get up here. Let's get up here and get some eyes on. See what we're up against. Ooh, we got somebody down here. Somebody right there. You're in a bad spot, Hunter. Osprey. Oof. That's a pretty good loadout. 55 tonner. Thunderbolt 20 carrier. Shit, that thing's got to die fast. And an archer. Well, this will be a nice fight. The same one that we... Pretty much the same archer we just faced. This guy's out of range of everything. I think they're all out of range. Well, uh, let's see if we can get a tag on this guy, because this guy's got to die. Target we confirmed. did. Nice. Okay. Yes, Commander. Here we go. Everybody spread out your hardware. I don't know if this guy's got HE rounds or not. But this guy's got to go. It'd be nice if we could pick this guy up as salvage, though. Come on, just one hit. Damn it. Receiving you. Well, if we can't hit him, it probably means he can't hit us either. Acknowledged. I'm worried about that Gauss Rifle, but I'm more worried about taking the 100 point damage from this thing's 100 pinpoints. That's actually pretty good. It's a good thing we have good targeting computer on this thing. Okay, a couple good hits. He's got pretty good armor. I thought this thing only had like 60 on the... Uh... Ooh, shit, he's got really good armor. He hit, too. Shooting for the Cloud Buster, but he hit the uh, Galopolis, didn't he? He did. Yeah, this thing's got great armor. I'm actually really shocked at how much armor this thing's got. Usually it's like 60 around the, around the board. But I haven't seen a Thunderbolt 20 carrier in quite a long time. This cloud bus is going to go down. Reporting minimal damage. Ah, uh, commander. Yeah, you're in a you're in the sucker's vehicle. Everybody shoots for the cloud buster for some reason. Maybe it's because it's accurate. Because of the um, fire control system flak. Yeah, we got to try and kill this guy. Just keep firing at him. Nothing. Nothing but air. Nothing but air. I'm kind of glad we started where we did. Because it kind of gave us the opportunity to see that guy before... Uh... Nice. Two good shoot downs. Before he got a chance to shoot at us. Give us the ability to get some direct line of sight on him. Because if we started back there, we wouldn't be able to shoot directly at him for quite some time. Leaving our Thunderbolt off for now until we need it. And yep. Firing. Nice laser hit. Bunch of missile hits. Nice. What now? What now? Alright. I forgot to mention it the last oh episode. Boy, I had an go. issue with Rogue Tech. It just all of a sudden wouldn't launch kept giving me exceptions and saying I should file a ticket and I'm like what the fuck is wrong and it just wouldn't launch and it what can I, do I had to you? force um, uh, force it to launch um, as a like me like as an administrator for some reason and I have no idea why I'm going to shoot at this guy I'm not even going to move right commander nothing Systems recycling for another shot. Waiting for orders. Anyways, I had to... I mean, I just downloaded, reinstalled it and everything. Figuring that was the issue. So I got a nice clean install of Rogue Tech, but I mean... That was not the issue. So 
I don't know what it is. Now it's running under administrator, so... I mean... At least I've got the ability to uh, to run it, but for a while there it just Move wouldn't it launch out. at all, no matter what I did. And it just like changed all of a sudden. It was like wasn't even between an update or anything like that. It was just Confirmed. one day it was working, the next day it wasn't. So bizarre. All right, now. Um, aye aye. Okay, we get better look at the TVM-20 carrier from up here, get some height, maybe better chance to hit. Lousy chance to hit. Man, I gotta get I gotta get targeting computers. We're getting killed here. Confirmed. Well, we at least we hit the archer. <laughs> I mean a, I don't it doesn't feel like a waste now, you know. <laughs> doesn't feel like a waste. That hunter is going to get a back shot on me, and I'll be in the water too, which means they'll have a better chance to hit me. Although we could play the let's go after the hunter game. I think we do that instead. Let's keep you away from that TBM carrier. Keep you as stealthy as we can too, and evasive as we can, and out of the water. And let's try for a quick kill. You got only an LRM-15, large pulse lasers bust. So yeah, I mean, pretty much straight from the back. Let's see if we can get a. Let's see if we can get a kill. Fuck's sake! Really? God damn! You miss with the lasers that are the easiest chance to hit, and you miss with them, like every time, just consistently. You gotta stop that! I don't like this gas rifle guy, but I like this thing's like an basically an ultra 20 gotta keep shooting at him until he's gone pass it to the top firing Locked on. okay good damage I think we splashed a bit onto this guy too he's going on 12 it's 14 a fucking gosh really yeah. reporting internal damage you're next, my friend. Waiting for orders. Get to here. Received. The question is. Question is, do we go after the better chance to hit like that? This guy hasn't fired yet, though. Can we get the kill, though? We'd have to land both shots in one location or hit this torso. So rather than wasting our chance to hit, let's fire on this guy. Now let's see how you handle this. Nice, both hit. I don't know what this guy's armor is like. 900. It's actually not bad for a 500 ton mech. I mean, it's not as good as my Wolverine, but... Yeah, we knew we were going to take damage. Uh, barely hit, Commander. Cloudbuster's a freaking bullet sponge. Yeah. Not even going to move. Targeting this guy. Fire everything. Engage the target. Looks like we penned. And we killed. Beautiful. Hostile eliminated. Big guns off the field. Hey. Let's focus on the idiots now. Mm, let's get as close to him as we can. Without giving that guy a side shot. Let's get into there. Because you know damn well that gas rifle is going to be firing at this guy. I mean, I would. Doesn't mean he will, but that's what I would do for sure. This guy's sitting in the water. Enjoy it, buddy. Here it comes. Yes, that was a leg hit for sure. Commander, calling out. I mean, I should be shooting at the Osprey at this point, but this guy's just giving me, giving himself to us pretty much. So, it was a torso hit that we hit that the Ultra. 
Ooh, let's go standard for the better chance to hit and firing. Lost evasive. Waiting on you, Commander. Don't even need to move. Uh, I'm gonna dump the rockets into him as well. Maybe we can get the kill this turn. Okay, all those things hit. Good damage. There's more where that Come on, came bail out, buddy. All out of short range missiles. Okay, commander. who's up? Granite. Okay, he hit you in the leg. We gotta retaliate against this guy, so that's what we're gonna do this turn. And firing. Nice. Head hit. Beautiful. Yes, Commander. I know what you you know what you need to do. You know what you need to do. Let's get on this Hold guy. On. Cause screw him. Screw you, buddy, screw you! We'll take the potential of the back strike with the LRM. Okay, good damage. Commander. Yep, getting to the side. The we'll dump everything into him again. Let's try and remove this guy. I'm going to fire the rockets as well. Uh, I'll leave the sensors off, though. Target confirmed. Ooh, two nice leg hits. That should be a knockdown. Out of SR. Yep, there it is. We can finish him off. Beautiful. He's almost knocked out. You know what we're going to do? We're going to try and machine gun him and knock him out. Go after the head. It's taking a bit of damage already. That thing's not doing a damn thing. Uh, I think we take that shot. Not enough for the knockdown, though, eh? Not enough for the knockdown, but we will definitely get it here. Well, we'll get the kill there. See ya. Hostile removed. This is gonna be What's so fun about? when we uh, activate the... Uh... Let's get into here. When we activate the... Um... Yeah, let's go there. When we activate the, um, the convoy, it's gonna be fun because we're gonna be standing right where the enemy is gonna be spawning pretty much. Um, how are you doing? Can't get machine guns on this guy, but we can take a pot shot at his head. And I'm gonna drop this to ER. Because I don't want to blow him up. No plink? No plink? I'm here. Can you get your machine guns on him? Oh, you can. Look at that. Look at that. We can drop the recoil at the same time. Man, it's so nice having this SM1. I really shouldn't say that, though, because some, somewhere along the line I'll get killed because I said it. Oh, nope, not enough. I hear ya. All right, Griff. Um, don't miss. No sweat. Nice. All right, see what you do. This guy's a lamb, I guess, eh? Because if he's not, he's built b bizarrely. <laughs> Let's see what he does here. Okay, nice. Orders. Now, let's try... Go to here. Moving out. See if we can get that leg. On. Here we go. Well, Reporting. there goes his ammo. And he's out. Awaiting orders. Excellent. Let's finish this guy up now. Rear armor it is. That's it, huh? Standing by. Alright, let's leave off uh, Thunderbolt 
and the AC, and we're just gonna fire the uh, Got the ankle. missiles. The shot. There we go. Target neutralized. Excellent. Waiting on you, Commander. Um, I, I'm pretty sure the enemies spawn over here somewhere, so we're just gonna set up on this hill and try not to get uh, for orders. our back facing them. On it. I have no idea what's going to show up here. It could, it could be heavy. I mean, it's a medium. It's a, like a, a two skulls, so... What? No. I think you got enough momentum. You do. Look at that. Okay, and lethal. By. Let's keep your momentum up. If we can, get around to there on the road. Nope. Here. Right there. Going full speed. Okay. Now let's hope the vehicles we get are actually relatively quick. Who's up? Wait, what? Yeah, Commander. Oh yeah, you. Uh, let's get in the trees. On my way. Look at the target you so we might as well get some reduction and we'll brace in the trees here. There they are. Okay, how fast are these guys? That's the good question here. Good to go. What do we got? We got prime mover, prime mover, and an ordinance transfer. Okay, transport. I know this guy's down there. Coordinates received. So we'll move to see who we got here. What do we got? Like another archer? A Clint, a Wolkan, Rifleman 2N, and a Crusader. Okay, a 35 ton Crusader. Or, sorry, 35. Dirt, 65 ton Crusader. It's actually pretty much the same chance to hit. Let's just target the Clint. Okay, we landed one AC hit. Not bad. Commander. ITF. Let's get down here. Affirmative. You're not going to get a chance to, hit, to shoot, I don't think. This turn, but that's fine. These guys will be tied up anyway. Oh, medium lasers can fire. Yeah, we gotta take a chance, why not? Reporting negative damage. Doesn't cost us any heat. Standing by. Alright, you. Let's get up here. Roger that. I think I wanna try and target that crusader. I think he's got LRM, so I wanna try to avoid getting oh shit, really? To avoid getting him to shoot the, uh, maybe we stay on this guy. Marginally better. Oh, we hit with one. Alright. Don't feel so bad now. I was going to say I want to get that Crusader to not shoot at the vehicles, but I think he's too far away anyway at this point. It's going to be a mech on mech battle here. Oof. Good shot. Stay away from my leg. Stay away you. from my leg. No sweat. Let's take the best chance to hit. Let's see if we can grind this guy up. I might take that PPC capacitor off. I don't know. I'm still up in the air about it. Last time we used it, it... it it failed on us and damaged one of our PPCs. Or sorry, no, that was the I. That was my fault. Sorry, I went with the. Uh, I turned the uh, FI off. Or I turned it on. Whatever it was, can't remember what it was. Okay, that's terrible. Let's move to here. Location confirmed. We can't let these guys get behind us, so we'll move over here. Yeah, best chance to hit on this guy. I'm going to leave the Thunderbolt until we get a 50% chance to hit, but we'll fire the rest of the stuff on this guy. Attacking from position. Oof. Alright, well. Splanch. Gotta get the splanch damage on him. What are you up to? Besides getting all your missiles shot down, pretty much. 
Ah, never mind. <laughs> Why do I open my mouth? I'm here. You guys know as soon as I open my mouth, this is bullshit. Ah, shit. I need to get some speed. So I need to get to... Actually, let's reserve you. We can let these vehicles move first before uh, you move. Because I don't want to get too far ahead of them and then not them, the back guy, not be able to move. Ooh, it's a peep version. Nice. I mean, he's not hitting shit, but it's kind of a nice loadout. What can I do for you? All right, Capitaine, how far can you get? Too far. There we go. On my way. Got a raker, do ya? Good to go. Uh huh. Okay, you got LRMs. Or an LRM. Oh, he's taking a lot of CT hits, that guy. Waiting for orders. It's a lot more than I thought he had. Okay, we can get to there. You got an LRM as well. Let's use that. Here we go. A couple points. Just keep the pressure up. What's up, boss? Let's get out of that fire. Moving out. Yeah. Still gonna take flame damage, nothing I can do about it. Just fire on this guy. Copy that. Nothing. That's a miss. Nothing. Waiting on you, Commander. Alright, Capitaine. You got an SRM. Where is there you are? Hey. Let's get up here. If you say so. Good to go. Alright, Lethal, let's see how lethal you actually are and see if we can claim this Clint. Uh, yeah, we'll take that spot. A little closer for the HE rounds. Alright, see if we can finish this guy off. Oof, even harder to hit with the HE. I guess we have to be super close for those. Alright, whatever. Whatever. Commander. Alright, Killjoy. Um, we need to switch targets here. Yep. Let's get on this Crusader. Push him out of the trees here. Alright, fire it all. Alright, not bad. Yes, Commander. Alright, let's go Copy fuck that. this Clint up. See what our chance to hit is when we get close to this guy, and if it's good, we might do a uh, offensive push. Mm, not as nice as I'd like it to be. What's he got left here? He's still got full... Let's just fire. Yeah, of course. At least he's unstable. Um, do we try and finish him? Flames on the way there, though. This thing runs so damn cool, it doesn't really matter. Roger. Um. Yeah, he shot me with his large laser. Let's try and get. Let's see if we can get the kill on this guy. Ultra's jammed. That's fine. Copy that. Okay, we hit with the uh, Start Thunderbolt. Taking a critical hit. Good to go. You can climb the hill, and we'll and fire now. on the Clint again. We're wasting too many turns in this damn Clint. Wow, 30%, huh? Is it better on anything else here? 63 on the Crusader. We'll take that. Ooh, two hits. Beautiful. What? No. Um, you can reserve. Does that sound good? Wait. Sure, sure why, why not? not? Just wait for the vehicles to pass you, then you can go. Do we have anybody else that goes before this Clint? Yes, Commander. Lethal does. Copy that. This should be... Yeah. There we go. Fuck you! One less target. I don't want him shooting this turn. If he hit with lot... If he... Ooh, this guy's super hot. If he hit last turn with that ER large, you'll probably hit this turn with it as well. Receiving you. This guy's right behind us now. Uh, 
Um, mm, I don't like that at all. Head now. Gonna go here. Not gonna give him. Got, not gonna give him the satisfaction of getting a backstrike on him. You screw him. Uh, I'm gonna go with the best chance to hit. I think. Let's fire at this guy. Engage. Target. Right about now, it'd be nice if we had the uh, the Griffin 2C in with the Inferno SOM ammo, but we don't. So, whatevs. Ooh, that's pretty nice. Coordinates received. This guy's a, this rifleman's trying to pass himself off as a discount marauder. Got it. There you go. That's what a marauder should be doing right there. All right, vehicles. Good to go. How far can we go? Not that far. Oh, there we go. Not bad. I read you, Commander. Moving out. Not bad. At least we've got vehicles with half decent speed to them. I hate it when we get like tanks that can't move anywhere. That takes like 15 minutes in real life to like get them to the out point. They have the three five movement. What can I do for you? Yeah, having the demolisher is great, but if it's not fighting, it's taking forever to get where it's going. Waiting for orders. All right, you can go down to there. Don't need to tell me twice. Let's fire on this guy. Uh huh. Take a few points damage to him. On you, Commander. Same thing with you. Coordinates received. Ah, thirty percent. That's Got not it. bad. It's respectable. Wish it was more than an LRM5, though. Uh, not you. Uh, you. I'm here. And let's just get up to there. Affirmative. And the vehicles are still within range. Okay, who's up? Yes, Commander. Killjoy! Affirmative. Taking on this Crusader. Even better on this Rifleman, though. Let's go on the Rifleman. Let's see if we can kill him this turn. He's taking a lot of damage already. Roger that. Nice. Got past the armor. What do you need? Just back Copy it up a little that. bit. I don't like this Vulcan moving in this close, but... He might actually be moving towards the vehicles. Um, which case I don't care about him actually. I don't I really want this guy gone, so let's try and kill him this turn. Firing. Roger that. Good damage. Inflicted some heavy damage. Order. Uh actually. Action E. Let's see what we can do with this. I don't know what this Vulcan's going to try and do, but he might try and get behind the Cephalus, but I don't know. We'll see. Firing an enemy pit. Oof. Penned. Make that guy reconsider Waiting his life choices commander. a little bit. I'm not, you're not even going to move. You don't even need to. Let's finish this guy up. Ooh. Good damage. When I shoot you, you'll take it and like it. Oh, he's gonna take it, but he ain't gonna like it. Alright, put you up here. Just getting the hell off of the dam. Yeah. Um, do we go with the LRMs? Do we need to? Probably. Well, I don't know, maybe not. We got seven turns of firing left. It's plenty. Just shoot them all. Shoot everything. See ya. The difference between him being a stick and dead. Let's make him dead. Oh, I think that was a jam of the uh, AMS system. Uh, minimal damage on that hit. Yeah, that's all right. Orders. All right. Coordinates received. Let's give this guy some stuff. Hey, what's up, dude? Target lock on. Should have thought about firing. I think. 
It's fine. Whatever. Down. You just take a nap. Hey. All right, you can reserve. Uh huh. These vehicles are all going pretty slow. Wait, who's up? Standing by. Oh, Hellcat. Yeah. All right. Let's put a couple AC rounds, AC five rounds into this guy's face. What's up, buddy? Yes. Pen too. You can reserve. Gonna come here until I see an opening. Yeah, you do that. How far can we get? God, not far at all. All right. I hear ya. All right, Capitaine. Can you get a little farther? Nope. That's pretty good. Double time. Hope these guys don't grab the kill off me, but whatever. Oh, it's a leg. Okay. Thought maybe we had a torso hit there. Huh? We'll take the leg. Waiting for orders. You know, I don't think I've ever had a Crusader in uh, in my entire time playing Road Tech or Battle Tech. So. Roger that. Firing on target. Can we choose some Crusader parts and see if we can put something together? I'm here. Yeah, you need to wait still. We got one more vehicle to move. Waiting on you, Commander. One more vehicle to move, and you can't go there somehow. Moving fast. Sure. Whatever works for you. What now? Okay, go to there. Okay, let's go. It sucks that I got to use my Ultra 20 to escort this guy, Standing but by. it is what it is. All right, we got a chance to pull the leg here, I think. Wait, are we on the right side? Are we on the right side? We are on the right side. Should I just shoot? Mm, not if I want to get the leg. I gotta probably do it this way. I hope we land the shot on the leg. Sure, whatever. We got one there. Which we probably could have got could have gotten if we just fired. Yes, Commander. Okay, get into there. Moving out. And then do the same thing. We got tons of resolve, tons and tons and tons of resolve. Um, we'll leave that off, but we'll fire the rest. Uh, sure. We have enough firepower for what's going to come next, so no biggie. Okay, let's get right up into here. Lots of resolve, so we'll just uh, do the same thing. Just needed one. That's all we needed. But apparently, we can't get that. What can I do for you? Just rotate it. Hopefully, this guy shoots for you. You got lots of armor, so. No sweat. All right, we got the leg there and the torso. Another hit, like. All right, down to two, three health. One to three health. Maybe we can finish him up with some... We might be able to get a shot to the head here. Wouldn't that be nice? There we go. Beautiful. I <laughs> never expected that to happen, but there you are. There you go. All right, I'm going to move everybody to the out point, and then we'll be back. Roger, full speed. All right, so we're about to move out here. I'm not 100% sure where the enemy Don't shows up. We'll find out here in a second. Oh, they're over the hill. All right. Sometimes they appear over the hill like that, or sometimes they appear over here. So, I mean, we got totally lucky um, what can I do for you? with their uh, positioning. Because they're pretty much out what now. They can't do much. Got they are out of the battle. There we go. They might get lucky and get one shot off if they got LRMs, but they're pretty much toast. All right, let's see what we can do here. Orders. It's going to take forever to get into uh, firing position. So what do they got here? Shadowhawk and a Warhammer. Ooh, nice. Panzer Halbitze and a Goblin. Mm, let's get along this way, maybe. 
Gonna hold off shooting until we got a direct line of sight. Awaiting orders. However, you. Um. I'm not in melee range, but you're definitely in uh, strike range here. Gonna put some sensors down as well. All right, we got one on. We got the tag on. Some sensors on. Got a little bit of on. <laughs> a little bit of everything. Uh, let's send you up. I'm not gonna send you straight into the face of a warhammer, but let's get up here. I think with the Marauder and the uh, Helopolis, we should be able to take that war Warhammer on in a ranged battle. Griffin, the Griffin generally has a uh, mixed bag of of um, like different ranged weapons, so I'm not so worried about him. Okay, what are they doing? Who's it gonna? Is it gonna be this guy? Sixteen? Yeah, I think it is. Everybody else is slower. It's gonna take a pot shot at the vehicles, probably. Yeah. Yep. Ha! Send me a real opponent. That's all hard. you're gonna get, my friend. That's all you're gonna get. Um. Where do I want to put you? Can we get up to the top of the hill? That's the question. I don't think we can. Well, Cloudbuster's tracks. So we might be able to get up here. You know what? Let's try it. We don't have a lot of movement here. We'll know next turn if we can get up this hill. Orders. All right, you. I have no problem moving in. You got plenty of evasion, so let's move it up. Extended range. Warhammer shot. Target acquired. Pot shot. Nothing. Man, the new Warhammer looks, I don't know. I kind of like the old boxy square design of the old uh, Okay. The old Warhammer. The new ones are kind of really sleek and they've got like more like of an elbow, whereas the Warhammers look like they just had like, with the PPCs, look like big hammers on the arms, right? Which I, which kind of like makes sense for Warhammer, for the name. But now you look at it and I'm like, eh, it doesn't quite make that much sense for the Warhammer. I hear ya. All right, you can brace everything up here. Resting my neck. Just hang out. You're out of here in a turn anyway. Did that, where'd the goblin go? It's back here. Okay. Ah, oh, fuck's sakes. Really? Waiting on you, Commander. They're gonna Send run into that damn down. valley and get caught down there. I don't know. I've had that in the past. Down smart. The old cool. Battletech game and the earlier versions of Rogue Tech. Affirmative. They, got it. they have a tendency that at the last bit to kind of go into the valley down here. Yeah, here he goes. They just don't see this as a way to get to the... For some reason, they don't see it as a way to get here. Aye, aye. It's just this map. So they'll, he, he'll go down, they'll, they'll go down into the valley and then just like... Acknowledge. Become sitting docks and they just, they stay down there, run back and forth. You bet it is. Because we're professionals. Alright, let's finish these guys off. Aye, aye. Alright, let's, uh... So that's the... the this side. We can probably only charge this thing. Oh, we can kick it. Let's give it a shot, see what happens. Roger that. See if we can kick in the side here. 
There you go. We'll still waste our ammo shooting at it, but... Enemy down. Gotcha. And anyone that tried to bail out. Tango down. We don't allow bailouts. We don't allow... Ooh, allow bailouts. We'll take the direct fire. Two AP Gauss rifles. Ooh, those would be nice. It's got three of them, though. One's damaged. A couple of plasma cannons. That's actually not a bad loadout for that thing. Shadowhawk 2C, eh? No armor on it, though. Taking the shot. Which is going to be its detriment here in a minute. Orders. Orders. Can you kill this goblin for me? We shall oh, see. I don't think the goblin's got a lot of armor. Probably an AC-5 and like an, a, 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 a machine gun or something. Machine gun large laser. Oh, right. Yeah, I remember this thing now. Oh, it does have a lot of armor. It's, it's got a, <laughs> but as much armor as a freaking Shadowhawk does. Waiting on you, Commander. Get over there. How... How slow can you go? Let's stay down here. Max speed, no shooting. Hopefully the road will give us a bit more speed. And those trees will... Yeah, Commander. Can you get up there? You can. Look at you, champion. Can't shoot at anybody, though. All right, we'll just pull up here, then. Roger. We'll just pull up here and take a look at the uh, sunset. We've got the Holopolis left. Two vehicles left. We're going to try and come around. Get behind these guys. Yeah, I think... They think that this is the way to go. Cause I think that's like a road or something. But they come down here and then they just don't go anywhere. Hey. Like you can get down that way, but get around to here. Alright. We're going for back strikes here, so. So we're going to go around them. Let's not give that Warhammer a clean shot at anybody before it dies. Okay, Goblin. Nothing. A couple machine gun hits. Light damage. Holding firm. Ready for orders. On my way. Double time. Okay, um... 15, I don't know what, 27, yeah sure, we'll just go with the ER, just get some hits in there, strip a little bit of armor, need you get to the top of that hill, um, you can't get a direct line of sight on that guy, but we'll get up here, let's drop some lerms on the uh, Shadowhawk down here. Hold off on the Thunderbolt. Drop some Lerm, see if we can pen that torso. Probably not. Because we're firing at it from the wrong side, I think. Yeah, no biggie. Yeah, see, they just... Moving, maneuvering themselves to die. That's what they're doing. Alright, we're... are we here? Which way are you facing? That way. So I think we want to kick you like that. Let's try again. Worked once, right? It'll work again. Attempting physical attack. Apparently not. Come on, lasers. No joy. Tag's on. Sensors are on. No short-range missiles remaining. That's all right. That's all right. He's going to be going down this turn or early next turn, one of the two. Commander. I don't really want to reveal to that Warhammer. I 
I don't think we have a choice, though. If we want to shoot the Shadowhawk, we got to reveal to the Warhammer. You know what? We're not we're not in a rush. Let's just move over here. We'll wait for the Marauder to show up. This guy's taking too much damage already. So we'll take a pot shot at this guy, though. Roger. Nah. Still got to find some HE ammo for the uh, 10. Thunderbolt 10. Commander. All right, TF, you should be able to just finish that Copy guy that. off, hopefully. Everything into his side. Nope. Do a lot of armor damage, though. Uh, Commander? You cannot get a shot off. Huh. Interesting. Okay, we'll come around here then. See if we can get behind them. Probably, I know we can get down this hill. Maybe we can get around behind them. I don't know. Okay, uh... No. You... Can definitely get around behind them. Let's uh, give this Warhammer the middle finger. What's up, yo? Oh, 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 oh goodbye. <laughs> it's ah, uh, it's so worth it. It's so worth it. All right, we're gonna hammer this guy. That was so good. Oh man, what they must think. You know, I could like that. What that Warhammer's worth? Like what, eight to twelve million C bills or something like that, or more? Because it's like probably got clan tech or some shit in it. And then it's just like a What's one vehicle that just comes around behind and finishes it off in one shot. What can I do for you? That's what you call busting a cap in their ass. Wow, this thing. I keep forgetting how slow this damn thing is. Now that we don't have the, uh, the supercharger. And that was a piss off, losing that in the very first battle. Let's just put the supercharger on and we'll... <laughs> ah, fuck. It's great when it works. Well, wow, look at you. Look at you. Standing by. Being all deadly and shit. No shooting. Just running. I got some deadly shit right here for you. And these vehicles are champions today. Alright, um H E it is, here it comes. Firing all <laughs> Enemy <dead>. Two for <laughs> two. <laughs> It's so worth it. Oh, okay. I had a, such a shitty day at work today, and that just makes up for it. It's just such a good... <laughs> oh, so enjoyable. So enjoyable. I'm glad it wasn't me on the receiving end of those, though. There we go. Nice. All right, let's check the salvage. Tango down. Wow. Mission successful. That was like 20 million in mechs brought down in a single turn by a couple of vehicles. Oh man, so, so good. So good. Oh, we did dig, take some damage in the uh, Talos though, but now that the uh, the battle on this planet's pretty much over, I should grab the ar some archer parts. I, did, I meant to check last episode. See, this is the inferior version. It's only got two laser hard points. Instead of four. But I should grab some. I mean, there's Crusader points here too, though. I don't think we have any Crusader parts at the moment. Hunter, Goblin. Four Osprey parts. Five Shadowhawk parts. Three, car three Thunderbolt 20 carrier parts. See, look at the armor on that. That's actually pretty good. But the movement is so slow, like... We would be relegated to using this indirectly for the whole time, you know? And I don't know how much ammo this thing carries. 
So as much as I'd like to choose those pieces, I'm probably better off grabbing, I mean, this is probably nice too. I'm probably better off grabbing the Warhammer and um, Archer parts so we can put them together. Ah, there's two Thunderbolt 20s here. 120 damage. Could you imagine if those landed? That would have been so bad for us. Although the Artemis is kind of nice too. For the battle computer. And there's the computers there. Don't need any of that stuff. Okay, Artemis ammo. I'm pretty sure this came off the Archer. We got one Tud. And there's the TBM 20 ammo. So, slug ammo for knocking shit down. Missile has 40 hit points. Three shots per. Faint ammo, kinetic kill. Merv, really? Separates after 120 meters. Splits into four fragments. It's actually kind of cool. Ooh, man. Do we grab the TBM-20s? Like, how much does the thing weigh? Although, we got plasma, half a ton of plasma ammo. It's only five shots, though. I don't think I saw the plasma rifle up here anyway. Indirect. Plus three indirect fire. There is a plasma cannon, clan plasma cannon. 12 tons. Still pretty damn nice, though. Like, honestly, how often do we see that? And there's two of them. Like, we could put together an archer with a pair of Thunderbolt 20s. But the problem is, is it's going to be ammo, right? It's all going to come down to ammo. Like, we'd have to grab this. Probably this. Probably this. That's air burst, though, right? Um, I don't know. Maybe we just hope we get some more. Like, I have to take the feint because there's three of them. That gives us enough rounds to be able to continue firing, even though it's not the best round. It just gives us less chance to get shot down by AMS, but also a harder chance to hit. And then maybe two archer parts. I mean, that gives us some options... This would be, I mean, we kind of really need this too. But I don't know what I would, I mean, I guess we'd take an archer piece out. Like, I know we got two pieces from the last battle. And I'm pretty sure we had one from before, maybe another one. This, at least me taking two, almost guarantees me putting together an archer. But not getting this would be um, a huge issue, I think. Ooh, do I go Thunderbolt or not? I mean, we don't have clan LRMs, so... Like, we could take the Artemis, a targeting computer. Why take the targeting computer, though?
because we could just get the Artemis here. Because, I mean, like, let's face it, chances are we're not going to be doing any kind of improve, like, um, an offensive push with this, with the, uh, uh, with the LRMs. We're just going to be raining shit down on the enemy. So, I mean, we could go with Artemis, Artemis Ammo. That's kind of taking the easy way out, though. Ah, let's try this. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? All right, we got an extra archer part. Two crusader parts. Nice, 100 pieces. We did get one piece of the carrier, which is good. Uh, we got two warhammer parts. That's awesome. Two LRM-15s. Machine gun, which I can probably just get rid of. We got the plasma cannon. That's nice. Two 180 cores, which I think I'll just straight up sell for the money. Fuel cell can go. We've got the uh, fire control system Artemis. Nice. Just regular LRM ammo. SRM ammo can go. Streak ammo will hold on to, I think. Yeah, we don't have any. And we got the Merv. So, I mean, we got... Oh, I mean, we got 10 turns of firing with both 20s. I mean, the other thing, too, is we don't have to install both 20s. We can just put one in and then some LRMs or something. Okay, 36,000, which is not bad at all. I know we have some internal damage on the uh, Talos, which is okay. But let's have a look at the mech bay. We do definitely have enough parts to put together an archer now, though. So let's have a look... Yeah, we got a, we got a, I mean, we got a heavy lance coming along pretty well here. We could be running two, like four, mech lances: Marauder, Archer, Wolverine, Helopolis. You know. So let's have a look here. The Ma I mean, we still have the Mackie too, right? Plus, we got Orions to put together. Oh yeah, we got tons of parts. So the five S was the one that we wanted. I thought for sure we had more Archer parts. Am I thinking of, uh, I may be thinking of, um, the Duelist series, or the Royals, that is. Two Warhammer parts. That's it for Warhammers. All right, well, let's have a look at the 5S here. This is the one with the four laser and four missile hardpoints, three support. Yeah, definitely the better of the two. So let's ready this guy with three parts here and confirm. That mech is ready to fight, Commander. All right, let's see what we get out of this now. I'm interested to see how much comes through. Um, we got plenty of sea bills. I should probably put together an Orion too while I'm at it. Like, um. So that's the primitive one. We definitely don't want that one. This is the one with the LB-10X. I think this is the one with the command console, isn't it? Yeah, this is the one that's got the command console in it. One ballistic, three laser, two missile. This is probably the same, right? Two ballistic, two laser, and two missile. I mean, the thing is, is we can put our own command console in because we have it. Two support, two support. But when we put this one together, we can take two parts from this here, right? So we can still have the full version of this one left over until when we get another Orion part, we can put one together. So that's a possibility. Now, the question is, like, because I, I like the idea of having two ballistic, because I, I believe it's one ballistic in each arm. I'm pretty sure that's how it goes because then we can put in, um, you know, a big, uh, either an ultra in each arm or if we can get some rotaries. Putting a, I, I'd love to go back to a rack five in each arm like we had in, um, God, how long ago was that? Was it the Night, was it the night Witches? No, it was, um, was it the Night Witches that had the, the, the two ultras or was it Jade Falcon Freeborn? I think it was the Freeborns that had the two ultras. But that was brutal back then. It's obviously different now. It wouldn't be it wouldn't be as, as devastating, but still. Long and extreme range accuracy. 
So you want to put like good long range weapons on this thing and just have it stand back and hammer people. That's when you get to level 20 with it. And with Predator, uh, Fire Control System Predator and the um, recon, is it recon sensors that give you the bonus at range. We'd be getting like plus six at extreme, plus five at long range, or some ridiculous shit like that. It would just be completely devastating at long range. Uh, but let's hold off on that one for now. Let's put the archer together first. Because we still have some mechs to come back, right? Actually move you up to there. Let's have a quick refit of this guy. Just to see what we get off of it and what we can do with it real quick. I'm probably not going to do a loadout just yet. Looks like we might have gotten a lot back. I'm not going to do a loadout just yet, but I will uh, definitely get it ready to go. So we lost the CT. We've got LRM-15. Two medium pulse lasers, which isn't bad. Let's repair it all. Yeah, I mean, we didn't get much. Some streaks. You know... You can carry a combat shotgun. <laughs> it's Max's armor. So we need at least a 210. We need a 280 core is what we need for a 4-6 movement. Um, question is, do we have a 280? I think we do. 275. Damn close, though. Let's just go with a 275 for now. Wow, we're already at 21 days and 500,000. Um, okay. Um, Weight-wise, before we go too crazy, let's just see what we're looking at weight-wise here. So if we go Heavy Pharaoh, I don't think we can, though, because we're not going to have the room. Definitely going with that. I'm interested to see how many hard points the... Uh, Thunderbolts are. Well, that's not too bad. Although we got like no space for ammo. Yeah, it's it's brutal because it's just so much. Um. Yeah, I don't know. It's a tough call. If we get an XL engine, like if we get a clan XL, it's uh, it's definitely viable at that point. At the moment though, it's not really that viable. Because we would have to hope for like really quick kills. So that's nine turns of firing. Ten, ten and a half turns of firing. I'm on my way. And we would have to hope that we were landing shots with this thing. Yeah, see this thing did have an XL engine originally. I don't think we have... I'm pretty sure we don't. Yeah, we don't have. Don't have an XL. I mean, that is an option though, is we just pick up a regular XL, because if this guy's standing at the back lines... As multiple people have pointed out, and rightly so, if this guy is just standing at the back line firing, running an XL is not such a big deal because it's not going to be targeted like the, the front liners are. So, I mean, short of something penning and blowing up a side, like with an ammo explosion, we would probably be fine. But I think for now... Um, I'm not like, like I said. I'm not going to do the loadout. We'll hold off. But for now, I mean, there's still the opportunity to go with um, an LRM build. So we take those off, and we could easily go with. Um, where are you here? A pair of 20s. 
Right, that leaves us lots of room. We need four, at least four tons of ammo, though. Which I'm not... I don't know what we have in ammo. We've got Tandem, which is only... That's only two turns of firing with both of these. We want to take this. I mean, we could load up Thunder. We would probably have to go this route. Because this is three turns of firing. Three, six, nine, if we were just going damage. So we'd have nine turns of firing. And then we'd have two turns of firing with the tandem because there's only 80 shots in this. We could use that against vehicles and then the thunder for lighter mechs. Three turns of firing there. So, I mean, that's... And we've got the shotgun as the backup weapon, which isn't much, but it's there. And then we can put a laser in each arm. You know? Something to think about. Like ultimately I'd love to replace two regular tons of LRM ammo with, or with Artemis rounds. Um, either that or LK, whatever we can get. Um, yeah. As far as lasers go, I mean we could go with a big laser. You know, let's grab a double heat sink kit real quick here. Regular double heat sink. So, I mean, it's not too bad. We could drop an exchanger in, that should solve the problem. And we ended up with a bit of, uh, Components installed in an invalid location. I have no idea what the hell that would be. What is invalid? Oh, we're overweight here. That's why. Why would the exchanger drop the tonnage of them that it can take? Um, that's confusing. Interesting, but confusing. So this has been fixed, the destroyed stuff. The fact that it's underweight, it's only half ton underweight, not a big deal. I mean, we can drop back armor off of this thing to get a bit more weight. Something like that. We got a ton and a half left over. So, I mean, we could put a heat sink in and then. Or do we just stay away from the ER large and just put in. Like a bunch of smaller stuff. Do we have ER mediums? I thought we had like three or four ER mediums. We don't. We got light PPCs though. They're three tons of pop. So, we could put one light PPC in each arm giving us a half ton left. It's about the same heat problem. Right? Yeah, I mean, that's not too bad. 31 days for to get it into play, though. I don't think we have any half tons of ammo, do we? Because putting another half a ton of ammo of something in would be nice, but we do not. Case might be nice, too. I don't think we have case, do we? We do. We don't have any space for it. <laughs> really? Well, I guess the armor goes back on. Do we just go this route? Like that? Probably do this instead, though. Get those torsos protected so the ammo doesn't cook off if we get attacked from behind. I mean, I, I'm, not, I'm not hating it. It's actually not bad long mid-range firepower. You know what? Let's just go for it. It's only a million. Sure. We'll get that into play. 
I normally wouldn't go with the light PPCs, but it works perfectly well with the Archer. The fact that we can get, um, we can mess with enemy sensors with this thing and, and do the same thing with the Marauder, it's going to help out overall, I think. Yeah, I don't feel bad about that at all. I think that'll be pretty good. Let's manage our tasks a little better here. Um, and then we'll advance the day just because I'm interested to see... Yeah, it's pretty good. Because I think we should have won that battle, in which case I want to get the uh, reward in this episode. That should be it right there. Yep. We have driven the forces off the planet, leaving you to celebrate victory with our crew. Let's see what we get for this. Something good, please. Half ton of AC2 ammo. Half ton of mortar fast cam ammo. TSM, a 240 core. One piece of a warrior. An AC5. Oh my goodness, four, five heat sinks. <laughs> Well, that's probably the shittiest one we've gotten so far. Like, <laughs> what the fuck? It's almost not even worth doing. Oh, well. Well, we made a lot of money off them. I guess I shouldn't complain. All right, guys, I'm going to end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And please drop your comments in the comment section down below. Let me, think, let me know what you think about that Archer loadout. I think it's not bad. And uh, maybe if you can think of some uh, a good double ballistic build for the um, Orion. I mean, the other thing too is it's got two missile hard points. The Orion, maybe the Orion becomes the uh, Thunderbolt carrier. But let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.